It was tactically spot on. We knew the French girl was uh, a really good amateur, had real good pedigree, had a good boxing style, and uh, it was important that Lucy didn't get carried away early on and sort of go running in charge and get countered. We knew we had to take that away from the French girl, and as the fight went on, then start taking over, start being the boss, and then making the French girl take her out of her. Oh, she was a tough, tough girl. Yeah, she was. Like, yeah. Um, Lucy hit with some big yeah, shots. That's it. She just took it. That's it. And then Lucy on the way out rolled out without her hands up. And she got caught with a big shot herself. And uh, yeah, so it made it a very entertaining fight for the crowd. Yeah, absolutely. But, but Lucy was very ta tactical and technical. And, uh, yeah, yeah smart. definitely. I mean, you can say that's probably fight of the night. I mean, yeah. so far. I mean, definitely. That's a main fight of the night. Yeah. Yeah. It's impossible to get your fight here. So she can be medically cleared. Yeah, she's coming. She's coming from the ring. She's coming from the ring. Yeah, so tell me about, um, sorry, just the taxes again, so you've, you've obviously studied um, Yeah, we've studied in this sub. Yeah. I mean, she was very, very uh, technical, like she would stay in the front of her so that she can then find her range and work with that big right hand, which, you know, credit to uh, Anissa, she did get that right hand off a few times. It was up to Lucy to move, change the angle of what her, her attack was, and uh, Lucy, when Lucy established that around four or five onwards, then she grew into the fight, found her rhythm and took over. Yeah, I mean, I think, I think the score card, what, what do you mean? Mm, to be fair, I knew the French judge was going to go the other way. I've been on the end of enough bad decisions. You've seen the ring, you looked. Yeah, yeah, I thought, what's going on here? Because I've been there as a fighter, but no, you know, she was, she was clearly a winner. From, from round six onwards, uh, you know, there was, there was no contention. And obviously, the early rounds that the couple they shared, and Lucy was on top of a couple of others as well, so yeah. she definitely won the fight. There was one point, I think, in round, I think it's four, uh, Lucy just said, Lucy's going to go away. Yeah. Like, in particular, you know, is she, um, you know, she's it's tied already, but yeah, it's, you know, no, it's it's new territory for both girls. Yeah. That's what it was. It's just a mental fight, yeah. Like, literally, it's just yeah. Yeah. hammer and tongs. That's yeah. it. Yeah. But yeah, no, obviously, you're happy with the performance. Oh, please, so um, please for Lucy. Fifth fight, yeah, five and that's zero. it. Um, what do you see next for Lucy? We have, we've contracted, there's another, there's another, uh, there's a, a, a non-title defence six rounder being contracted okay. in, in Norway, Lucy Gant in Norway, to, to, to box uh, another Sweden, another Swedish, no, it's not Salmon, it's uh, another Swedish girl that resides in Spain, okay. and uh, Joanna Ekpedal, and uh, that's, that's going to be, a, that's a big fight, that's going to be even tougher than tonight, yeah. so okay. we're making small steps with Lucy, but going on the right path. <laughs> In the UK. She's based in the UK. Uh, and is she English? Sorry, this is me. No, she's Swedish. She's Swedish. She's Swedish, okay. but she's based here, resident here. Got an English name. Got a, got a British uh, boxing board control license. So uh, she's flying the flag for Sweden, stroke UK. So, Fantastic. Yeah. Um, okay, before we go, do you, do you talk about your own fighters in the gym uh, that you've got? All right, so uh, I'm from a home church. I'm from an amateur gym, home church in Hong Park. Yeah. Uh, we've only been on the map with them. We took over a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. It's our second year in charge, and uh, yeah, we're getting the amateurs out on the road. Uh, I'm training some guys during the day that are contemplating turning pro. Uh, but yes, as I said, small small steps. I'm, I'm getting them all learning the basics first before I sort of come out with anyone else. Uh, I know you've been working with Ben Hall. Ben Hall, yes. Uh, yeah, tell me a little bit about that. Uh, ben able to come back soon? Yes, hopefully Ben's back soon. Uh, he's got to get all his medicals done yeah. and reapply his licence. There's some uh, sort of ballroom stuff he needs to get sorted. Yeah. I can't sort it for him. Uh, but as soon as that's done, we can go before the board and get his licence back and, and crack on. Yeah, it's because I did an interview with him in, um, I think it was October. He's obviously looking to try yeah. and, I think, it's October, it's October, it's October, it's October, it's October. So you could see him back. Too. Yeah, it's definitely a couple of years out. He's got talent. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. stuff. Um, okay, uh, before we go, any. Any other fighters that you potentially got going on? No, that's it. Just just focusing on, on Lucy, that's in the gym all the time, yeah. uh, and the amateurs. And uh, yeah, if, if, I think this is the year I'll go out to like the, the Harringay Box Cups and the other competitions and just have a look around and, and scout yeah. and uh, yeah, go from there. But I'm not, I'm not in any rush or desperate need. Lucy approached me and I said, you know what, I think I could do your turn. And that's where we are. Yeah, fantastic. I know you sometimes come down to the gym and see some of your amateurs that we more than welcome, yeah. Um, cool. Uh, oh, do you want to show our social media? Uh, social media, so people can follow you. All right, so, uh, yep, yeah, I'm on Facebook, Colin Lines, and uh, I don't do Twitter, I don't do uh, Facebook, but uh, Instagram, but Lucy, Lucy, follow Lucy. If you want to follow me, you can follow me through Lucy. Or get behind Lucy, and then you get to me. Yeah, fantastic. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you very much.